Back to school continues for students across West Michigan with thousands of kids returning to the classroom this morning, including in Ottawa and Kent counties. 13 on your sides. Veronica Ortega is live this morning in Holland speaking with school officials about some changes families could see this year. Veronica. Good morning, Emily and Meredith. No doubt it's going to be a busy morning for parents, students and teachers as they get ready to head back to school today here in Holland. I'm joined now by the the school district's superintendent, Nick Cassidy. Good morning, Nick. Good morning. And how excited are you to welcome back students today? I'm really excited, a little nervous, but yeah, we're, we're good to go. We're ready and we're just so excited to have them back in the building and, and start this year. This is a hoping to be a normal school year that we start off with the first one in three years. So um, there's a lot of excitement coming in and a lot of new blood bringing uh, that excitement to Holland. Yeah, speaking of new blood, something we talked about last hour was the number of new teachers that are starting, which is very unusual because we've heard stories about teacher shortages in different school districts, but that's not the case here in Holland. Yeah, we're we're in a really good spot right now. Where we've hired about 30 new teachers coming in, um, but even our administrative team is is really new. Um, we've had a lot of internal movement and promotions within, so we have about uh, over half of our building administrators are new or in new positions as well because of all the the internal movements. But so there's a lot of excitement coming into this year and uh, a lot of fresh ideas. Um, what about bus drivers? That's another issue that's yeah. plaguing school districts. Yeah, we could use some more bus drivers as every district around here. So if you have your CDL and you'd like to talk, please give us a call. But, uh, you know, bus runs are really tight um, and we're making it work. But um, we just ask parents to be, you know, use some, uh, give us some patience as we come through and work through this. The bus drivers are running multiple runs to make it work this morning with limited bus drivers. So Absolutely. Very briefly, any new changes that families can look forward to? Um, yeah, we have, we've been through a lot of our phase one of our bond projects and building improvements. We have new playgrounds at Holland Language Academy and Jefferson is still finishing up their playground. Um, some interior renovations at the middle school in Jefferson, and then we'll move into some bigger um, construction projects next year. But it, it was a scramble getting our schools ready, but we're, we're ready to accept kids and, and families this morning. Absolutely, a lot to look forward to. Thank you so much, Nick. I appreciate you being here. And for more on our back to school coverage, you can visit our website, 13onyourside.com. I'm gonna send it back over to you guys.